In this video, I'm going to create a document skill to process commercial invoices. Then I'm going to use Vantage Advanced Designer to improve this skill. I will go to the Skill Designer, Document Skill, then I will name my skill and click Create. For this demonstration, I'm going to train the skill to extract only two fields, Total and Currency. You can see that I mark up fields and create labels in this sped up part of the video. After I trained my skill, I noticed that on some documents, currency wasn't detected. This could happen because I have a very small document set. So what happens if you don't have enough documents to train a skill properly? Advanced Designer might save the day. I'm going to publish my skill then edit it in Vantage Advanced Designer. Now, as I've opened my skill in Advanced Designer, I should go to the Activities tab and add the Extraction Rules activity to the pipeline. With this activity, I will be able to adjust all necessary settings for detecting the currency field. On the Activity Properties panel to the right, you can see the two extraction fields I've created in Vantage. I will now work only with the currency field, so I deselect total. In the extraction rules activity, I need to open the fields tab and disable the currency field. I will re-enable it later. I will also delete the currency element from the search elements tab. I need to find the keyword total, but there's a small problem. Two out of the three pages have the words subtotal and say total on them, and I don't want Advanced Designer to inadvertently detect these words. So I will create a static text element that will help me exclude these non-targeted values from the keyword search area. I click match and see that the values subtotal and say total were detected correctly. Now I can search for the keyword total. I will copy and paste the existing static text element, name it keyword total, then enter the search text total. Then I need to draw a search area, left click on the subtotal value, and exclude it from the search area. After matching, I can see that the total field was found successfully on all documents. Finally, I should create a character string element for locating the currency value. I'm going to create a simple regular expression to search for three uppercase letters or a set of currency symbols. I will also set up the maximum number of words as one. The search area for the currency value will be to the right of the keyword total and nearest to this keyword. After matching, I can see that all the currency values were detected successfully. Before publishing the skill, I need to open the Fields tab again, enable the currency field, and map it to the corresponding character string element. Now I can publish my skill. After publishing in Advanced Designer, the skill will automatically appear in the Vantage Skill Catalog. Let's try the skill out. As you can see, the currency value was successfully extracted from all documents.